Good evening, builders. Krosama here. So what we're going to be doing is learning a few things right now. I'm going to teach you about tuning up items. I'm going to teach you about uh, how to increase the level of traits and increasing the level of EX skills. I'm also going to show you exactly how to get platinum coins and how much you can get. Uh, so f first thing I want to show you is going to be uh, tuning up parts. Now you can go to Gumpa Build or you can go to the parts section, but you know I'll just go here. So what you're going to do is you're going to ha um, long hold on an item and it's going to bring up this little menu. Now also key thing, if you want to favorite an item, because sometimes you don't want to like uh, accidentally transfer something, you're going to click that little favorite and it's going to lock in a part and you just can't transfer. You have to like unlock it. Um, but if you want to tune up an item, well, let me explain what tuning up is. So tuning up is the process of increasing its overall rarity to the next level. So it's going to cap at 25 at the at two stars. Now when you get to uh, three stars, then it's going to cap at 40. And then when it gets to uh, four stars, then it's going to be 60. And then finally at five stars, it's going to be uh, 80. Now the thing is, some of these parts are just not worth tuning up at all. I get it, we all have like our favorite suits that might only be a one star rarity, might only be a two star rarity. But, you know, spending a lot of these resources is going to be draining your overall pool. Um, so I would honestly recommend you looking only at uh, default threes or default four stars. Primarily four stars, uh, but I mean, obviously four stars are only going to go to five stars. So make sure you always have a resource pool that you can power these up. Don't like, like me, I'm not going to drain all my, um, my greens and blues and everything uh, for, you know, some basic parts these are very very basic sorry it turned off uh, so what you want to do is just press tune up I'm not gonna do it here because I really don't want to waste these parts and I don't have anything I really want to spend them on uh, but for the most part these are your parts that you can just increase the level and they're gonna get they're gonna get better honestly but you need to look at this is a key thing you need to look at how this part is gonna benefit you in the long run if it's something that does not have a good trade something that does not have a good EX skill Trust me, it's not worth powering up. Find something else. Okay, so let's say you want to uh, increase an EX skill or a trait. This is this is all you need to do. So you go to the part. You're going to go to upgrade, right? Now, when you are looking at your parts, you, you, know, you have your items that you're going to be default um, selecting. Now, you slide over here to parts. You have to choose the exact same part. Now, let's say my rising uh, leg right here. Let's just say it's, it's, in, um, it's a level four. It's a, it's a four-star part you can still use these three stars and see how it's going to go up there so i've already maxed it out i'm not now you see how if i just press this it's going to go to uh, yellow right you don't want to do that you want to wait until you actually increase the overall level of this part so whenever i do get this part to four uh four stars at that point i'm gonna do another uh, increase because if i do it right now i'm gonna be missing out on a lot of experience so I'm just not going to do it at all, and I'm going to wait. And I am going to be powering up the uh, the Rising Gundam. I think it's going to be a pretty good mo uh, mobile suit, and I already have all the parts for it. So I'm like, you know what? Let's just go ahead and do that. So yeah, this is it's going to be the same for EX skills as well. All you're going to do, press the same exact part, and bam, you're going to be able to level up. So make sure you're watching your level gain. Don't just do excess. I would say get to one level below and then whenever you max out like whenever you go one level below so right now it's level five sorry I, even though i have notifications off it still chimes uh but yeah it, you want to get to level five before you, uh before you max it out increase your parts level then it'll go up another uh level uh, another two levels uh then i can go ahead and power it up once more and then power up one more time to max out at level 10 and you're good now platinum coins what are platinum coins you go to coin exchange right you go to platinum coin exchange and here you're gonna have a list of items now these items are gonna rotate on September 1st so it's best it's either they're gonna rotate and they're gonna have something new or it's just gonna be completely replenished and you can buy them all over again so these are really these are the main resources you need And if you see down here you have a lot of awakening circuits uh, so I definitely bought all those out the rest of these these nippers I, I honestly believe you don't need them like Powering up my uh, MSs have been has been super simple through just missions, um, doing them through missions or using white parts because you can use uh, just the one stars or even the two stars. But I don't recommend using two stars. You can use one stars and it's going to uh, be able to you know boost the experience of a said part. But honestly, I've just been doing the missions and leveling up my parts that way. Now, if you do want platinum coins, this is what you got to do. You have to sell. You go to the sell tab. You have to sell green blue or purple parts 
So just, I'm gonna show you exactly uh, how much is gonna be going for. So a green part is going to give you one coin. I'm not selling that, but um, now I go over here. Well, I'll select the blue, and then I gotta unselect uh, the green real quick. But you go here to sell. A blue part is gonna give you three coins. Now, I don't know if, okay, I'll sell. All right, so let's go right here, unselect that, and we're gonna select a purple. That's gonna give you 15 coins so that's pretty damn good uh obviously if, if you have a purple that you really just don't want then go ahead and sell it probably one of the better methods i would say is just to spend some resources it, it, this is only if you really want platinum coins um but maybe like boost up a uh, a force like a um a blue part increase it all the way to a um a a uh, four star and then sell it for 15 but honestly, you're spending resources that you're buying with the coins, so it's it's going to defeat the purpose. What I would just say is maybe not even sell uh, four star parts. I I don't sell them because they're they're rare. I mean, these are parts that is very hard to come across. So it'd be better if you have duplicates. Either use the recycle method, or you're going to go ahead and um, just power it up with you know the same method I, I taught you earlier to increase those traits or EX skills. But hey, that's it for me, guys. Um, now I guess I'll teach you to recycle things since I'm here. So I don't have I don't have parts I can actually do this uh, with. But all the um, it, this only works for uh, four stars. So you're gonna use three four stars. It could be like three arms. It could be like two arms and a uh, a, a backpack. Uh, it cannot be weapons or shields. But you select three of them and you basically re-roll them. Now they have to be the same mobile suit. So it has to be like three Barbados parts. You're gonna select all three. You go down there to uh, recycle selected parts, and you you basically get a chance on getting one of the five parts. So you either get a head, arms, um, body, legs, or a backpack. So you can potentially get the same exact part that you recycled. Do I recommend this? Not really. Uh, but if you're really just trying to get one particular part and you haven't been doing good with the gotcha and you have all these excess parts, hey, go ahead and try it. So that way you can complete your set. But I would. I would definitely say just use it to increase uh, EX skills as well as traits. But hey, that's it for me, guys. Uh, definitely want to show you some of these little you know tools and tri uh, tips. I know I kind of sound a little grungy right now. It's like midnight. I'm, I'm like super tired. But I was like, hey, I really want to get this video out for you guys. Uh, so this will be uploaded my next morning. But hey, uh, I want you to go ahead and let me know in the uh, description down below. What do you want to learn? Is there, well, not in the description, but in the comment section below. Is there something that you want to know? Is there something that you would like to see me you know, do some kind of coverage on? If so, let me know in the comments and I'll try and get that done for you. But other than that, guys, thank you for watching. Thank you for being a part of this channel and this community. Really, really appreciate it. I've, I've kind of been blown away at how fast uh, we've been growing. So, you know, if, I, I'm going to keep on making these videos if you want to keep on watching. Uh, but other than that, guys, thank you for watching and I'll be seeing you in the next video. Bye-bye.